General Hospital spoiler said Sean's unjust case cost him a lot of work to clear up. Fans also recalled that when Sean's murder trial took place, even though he didn't kill Hayden, all the evidence pointed towards him. Sean had no way to prove his innocence, so he was sentenced to prison. During his time in prison, Sean was still burning with intention of finding out the truth of the matter. So, after he was released from prison, he immediately started investigating the case. Over a long period of time, Sean and Alexis discovered that it was Nicholas who killed Hayden County and then blamed Sean. Nicholas is a very conspirator. He wants to deal with Alexis on a matter. Alexis is now in jail for stabbing Dante. Nicholas tells Alexis that he will offer to pardon her on the condition that, her, that she sever her alliance with Sean. It must be said that this condition is very attractive to Alexis. She discussed it with Sean, and after some hesitation, he advised her to agree to Nicholas's terms because in this situation, Alexis needed to get out of prison first. Sean also begins plotting a plan to expose Nicholas's crimes, and he knows that now the only person who can do this task is Spencer, Nicholas's son. Returning to the case of Spencer, he did not like his father and stepmother Ava to continue their relationship, so he and his girlfriend Esme tracked and threatened Ava. Soon after, his crimes were discovered by the trio of Trina, Jocelyn, and Cameron. They set up a trap for him to confess all his actions in front of everyone. Nicholas was very angry and kicked his son out of the house, cutting off all finances. Spencer is in danger of facing legal problems. He was extremely sad when his father was so heartless, and this is an opportunity for Sean to take advantage of Spencer to his side. At the same time, Sean also feels worried and uncertain that Spencer will agree to betray his biological father. He wanted Spencer to not waver as he watched Nicholas pay for his mistakes. To do that, Sean needs to influence Spencer's psych a lot. He had to show Spencer that Nicholas's sins needed to be exposed to the public. It's time for Nicholas to pay for all his mistakes, and in fact, Nicholas was even more wrong when he blamed Sean, causing him to spend a long time in prison, and if Spencer agrees to help Sean, his relationship with his father be becomes very bad and difficult to repair. Therefore, Spencer needed to make sure he could handle all the consequences of accusing his father of shooting Hayden when he sided with Sean. Spoilers suggest that Nicholas once yearned for his father's affection. He did a lot of things to make his father with his make his father relationship become closer. However, Spencer's approach was a bit extreme and angered Nicholas. He cut off everything with his son and went to Ava again. This made Spencer feel abandoned and very lonely, so he can side with Sean to find evidence that his father shot and killed Hayden. Has Spencer made a final decision yet? And can he accept that the father-son relationship will be completely broken if he accepts to cooperate with Sean? As for Sean, he, he is now free, but he still wants to find out the truth and get justice for Hayden. He wanted the real killer to be punished. However, this task is not easy. And will Spencer betray his father? The truth that Sean wants to expose must be paid with the relationship between Spencer and Nicholas. It can be seen that it is an expensive ending and how will it play out?